Welcome back, fight fans. Welcome to Fuck Back. Let's just dig right into it. Deontay Wilder and Tyson Fury fight is drawing near, according to sources. And if you look at this fight, I think that this is a bad move for Deontay Wilder. I think this is the dumbest fight that Deontay Wilder can take in the rematch with Tyson Fury. I think the smart move for Deontay Wilder is to immediately fight Anthony Joshua and for Undisputed. Because ultimately, all roads lead to Anthony Joshua. All road leads to the biggest fight in the heavyweight division, and that's against Anthony Joshua. Tyson Fury is not the biggest fight. Uh, you know, Deontay Wilder is not the biggest fight. The biggest fight is Anthony Joshua, the guy with the most belts, the biggest name, and the biggest payday in the division. I understand why that, you know, Deontay Wilder and Tyson Fury both want this fight. Uh, Tyson Fury is just going to use this fight should he be victorious. As you know, it's just more of a bargaining chip in the Anthony Joshua fight. I get it. Deontay Wilder's looking for the same thing. But if you're being honest and unbiased when you assess this particular situation, you see that Tyson Fury doesn't need this fight. Tyson Fury doesn't need this fight. Tyson Fury's already beaten Deontay Wilder in the eyes of the public. And the vast majority of people who are unbiased know that Tyson Fury already beat Deontay Wilder. So if you look at Deontay Wilder, he's incredibly desperate for this fight. He needs this fight to show the world. But here's the problem with the outcome of this fight. We've already seen a less than 100% Tyson Fury come out and put on a boxing masterclass against Deontay Wilder. What is Deontay Wilder going to do at this point? that's going to be any different we've never seen Deontay Wilder make any boxing style adjustments we've never seen Deontay Wilder do anything different other than what he's always done he's lost rounds to Gerald Washington Eric Molina Arthur Spilka much lesser opponents and now the fact that Tyson Fury who's a pure elite level boxer is going to get another crack at you a guy who's already felt your power got adapted to your style went 12 rounds with you and you couldn't stop him there's going to be no difference in this fight Tyson Fury will do much better this fight and it will be so much easier because he's a much better boxer boxing pays the bill skills pays off it's not just about picking one shot to try to hurt a guy Deontay Wilder is making a tremendous mistake and this is why because should he should he take this fight and should this fight shows that it's official and these guys get everything but just like the reports are saying Deontay Wilder is going to lose this fight he's going to lose his belt clearly and what will happen at that point is Deontay Wilder will be out of the Anthony Joshua sweepstakes Deontay Wilder will no longer be a notable name in the heavyweight division and Deontay Wilder will be fighting second tier heavyweights because we already know that Deontay Wilder is exposed it's only just a matter of time before his belt goes this is his last big payday why not make your last big payday against a guy like Anthony Joshua for undisputed because should you land that lucky punch should you come out and be victorious why not take all the glory and all the belts and make history go for history instead he's taking the idiot approach and trying to fight a guy in a rematch instead of going for history the biggest payday of his career and what makes the most sense i understand that deontay water is clearly ducking anthony joshua but at the end of the day the tyson fury fight will ruin his career once again unbiased as always this is the ibfp please share like and you must absolutely subscribe